This is a demonstration video of the Decca record player. I'm just going to show you how to use it so that you'll be familiar with it when you receive it. When you receive it, the first thing you'll need to do is to screw down the two transit screws on the record deck located here and here and screw those down all the way fully clockwise so that the deck floats on its springs. Also, unclip the arm. The on-off switch is located here and the amplifier controls for tone and volume are here. Speed control is on the left, start stop on the right and size selection is automatically detected. So you can stack between 1 and 10 records. I'll demonstrate with 2 just so that you can see how it plays. So just pop the records onto the spindle ledge and put the stacker arm across, select the correct speed and then to start the auto changer flick the right hand control knob all the way around. And if you want to skip to the next record, just flip the right hand control knob all the way around again. So I'll just demonstrate with the start of a 12 inch record as well. When you stack a 10 or 12 inch record, the white lever at the back is the size detection system. So you need to make sure that the record is stacked above the white lever, like so, and that's so that the playing arm knows to land in the correct position. And of course the arm lifts off automatically when it reaches the end of the record. If you don't want to use the auto changer and you just want to play one record manually at a time, then you can just pop an individual record down the spindle onto the platter and select the first option on the right hand dial which says manual. That will start the turntable turning and you, then you can place the arm onto the record yourself. Once the arm is on the record and it's playing, lower the stacker arm down like so, so that it knows to switch off automatically at the end of the record. If you leave it playing with the stacker bar left in the upright position, like so, that will trigger the repeat function, which is for 7-inch records only, and it will replay the same 7-inch record over again until manually switched off. So I hope that covers everything, but if you do have any questions, I've included my personal email address in with the machine, and please use that method to contact me.